Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Mark Shelf Space, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Marvel Legends Spider-Man Retro Cyborg Spider-Man figure. So stay tuned and we'll get to it. Alright, so here is the Marvel Legends Spider-Man Retro Spider-Man figure. I don't know about you guys, but this one gives me a real kick in the nostalgia gems. Looking at this, uh, just thinking about the Toy Biz Cyborg Spider-Man that was released a long time ago. I think back in the mid-90s. Put a picture up here. Take a look at that one. But this one definitely uh, brings back some good memories. So for anyone wondering where did Cyborg Spider-Man come from, originate, first appear... He actually first appeared in Spider-Man number 21. Uh, this was back in the 90s, uh, the, the 90s Spider-Man series. And he was in a battle with Solo. And Solo injured his arm. Spider-Man was taken back to Care Labs where he had his arm uh, protected inside a, a, a cyborg metal case here. And he meets with Deathlock in the book and they, they team up and... Take on the Sinister Six, and Deathlock tells Spider-Man that Care Labs is not actually, um, does not have the best interests, his best interests in mind, and they're actually an evil outfit. So they battle the Sinister Six, and Cyborg Spider-Man's arm is actually vaporized during the battle by one of the robots. And that's it for Cyborg Spider-Man until years later. So take a look at the card here. Got the artwork on there. It's pretty good artwork. The classic card. I really love the classic card. And on the back here, a little blurb about Cyborg Spider-Man in a few different languages. And the same art from the front of the card. Let's open it up and we'll take a look at him. So Cyborg Spider-Man comes with two accessories. The first is a punchy fist here. Because every good superhero needs to do some punching from time to time. That, and I suppose this is a pretty simple ad for Hasbro to keep molding over and over with different colors. I like it though. Next is the web. Because Cyborg Spider-Man needs to do some web swinging. Now we'll take a look at the figure himself here. Got that pretty cool 80s Rambo bandana going on here. I like it. Keeps all the sweat out of his eyes. Or I guess it's just for style. And he's got this eyepiece here. So he can see better. Imagine it gives him some infrared capabilities, maybe some night vision capabilities. But uh, detail on that is good. I like it. I wonder how it stays on his head, though. You'd think this suit would be kind of slippery. Maybe the bandana ties it down. I don't know. Uh, take a look at the body here. So he's got a belt. Keep all his little gizmos on. My belt's pretty fixed on there. Let's take a look at this arm. Got a cool steel plating on top here. Pretty standard articulation. And the elbows and the wrists. So he's got his cybernetic punchy fist here. So you can put this punchy fist on this hand here, on this arm, and now he's a double puncher. But I think, but I think I'll keep the web shooting hand on because I like it better. It looks cool. See the other arm here. Standard arm, same articulation. 
the paint on this I mean this is a really nice detailed painting the lines the black lines here are clear really crisp and the blue and red they're they're a good blue and red color and bring out the classic spider-man take a look at the legs here he's got a bandage on his right thigh there see the articulation in the knees and then the ankle swivels yeah these black lines on this are painted really well I like them I don't see any smears or anything got a hole in his back here if you want to hold him up and pose him somewhere and then the abdomen it's clicky articulation but doesn't bother me all right and here he is side by side with deathlock just as he was in the classic spider-man cover pictured here looks about the same overall really great figure I'd highly recommend picking him up if not just for nostalgia reasons but because he's a great figure paint job's great the joints are not too loose and not too tight and the mold is, is perfect for spider-man so I hope you guys like that uh, if you did please click the like button and subscribe and I look forward to putting out some new content shortly. Thanks.